Hi guys, welcome to day one of week 5, 10, 15. Yes, week 15, day one of week 15, Kids Daily Devotion. My name is Auntie Rashida. Okay, let's jump right into our lesson for today. Our scripture reading will be taken from 1 Samuel 1, verses 26 to 28. And our memory verse is 1 Samuel 16, verse 7. We'll first read from the King James Version. And she said, O oh my Lord, as thy soul liveth, my Lord, I am the woman that stood by thee here, praying unto the Lord. For this child I prayed, and the Lord had given me my petition, which I asked of him. Therefore, also I have lent him to the Lord. As long as he liveth, he shall be lent to the Lord, and he worship the Lord there. The New International Reader's Version reads, Hannah said to Eli, Pardon me, sir. I'm the woman who stood here beside you, praying to the Lord, and that's just as sure as you are alive. I prayed for this child. The Lord has given me what I asked him for. So now, I am giving him to the Lord. As long as he lives, he'll be given to the Lord. And there Eli worshipped the Lord. Let's honor God's holy word by saying, Thanks be to God. Alright, it's time for us to explain what we have just read. Hannah prayed to God for a baby. God answered her prayers. He gave her the desire of her heart. He gave Anna a baby boy. Yes, and she named that baby, Baby Samuel. Yes, God is so good to Hannah. Hannah had a heart of gratitude, a heart of thankfulness. And because of the heart that Anna had, she gave that baby Samuel to God. She carried Samuel, when he was old enough, maybe a young boy, to the tabernacle to stay with Eli. Anna gave the baby to God because she was happy for the blessing God gave to her. So, God gave her a baby and she gave out the baby to God. That is good. Okay, Samuel stayed in the tabernacle with Eli. Anything that Eli was doing? Samuel was always there assisting and he grew there in the tabernacle till he became a great, good-looking young man. All right, now let's apply what we have learned today. Hannah did not know that God wanted Samuel or chose Samuel to be the prophet to Israel. God will always have a plan for all of us lives each and every one that is. God had a plan for Hannah's life, which is for her to carry that baby boy Samuel, who he will use to be the prophet to Israel. That is good. Whenever God blesses us, we should always give back to him. He will appreciate it. And that shows that we have a heart of thankfulness and we are showing appreciation. All right, for our activities today, just look at the screen and for those with your journals, you will see the activity. Fill in the blanks. You can find your answers right here in your memory verse. That is 1 Samuel 16, verse 17. So go ahead, my boys and girls, fill in your answers and you can indeed share it with us. Before we go, let us just say this prayer together. Heavenly Father, thank you for always carrying out your plan. Amen. One last thing before we go guys, let us repeat our memory verse that is 1 Samuel 16 verse 17. 1 Samuel 16 verse 7. Let's do the King James Version first. But the Lord said unto Samuel, Look not on his countenance, or on the height of his stature, because I have refused him. For the Lord seeth not as man seeth. 
For man looketh on the outward appearance, but the Lord looketh on the heart. The New International Reader's Version, memory verses. But the Lord said to Samuel, Do not or consider how handsome or tall he is. I have not chosen him. The Lord does not look at the things people look at. People look at the outside of a person, but the Lord looks at what is in the heart.